wish you'd dance like that for me. I can. I'll put my Godzilla mask on for you, too. <laughs> Howdy, folks. We're going back to you, me, and the movies. And it's Kaiju Week. Because Godzilla X Kong, the new empire, hits theaters this week. And to celebrate, we're watching a King Kong movie and a Godzilla movie this week. Amazing. We're going to watch the 1976 Jeff Bridges starring King Kong. I do like Jeff Bridges. And uh, Jessica Lange's also in this. A young Jessica mm, Lange. Yes, yes, this would so be you get to see that role. An early role for her and compare it to uh, how she is today in American Horror Story. All right. I imagine there's less dialogue for her in this role. You never know. I guess. You never know. I imagine just more screaming. But yeah, this is the King Kong movie that basically all the King Kong stuff at Universal Studios was based off of for the next 20 years. But so yeah, remember, like, him the, climbing the, the, the tower. And all that and... stuff was based off of this movie. Okay. So. Sweet. Lots of nostalgia and. So much I, nostalgia. I believe this won an Academy Award for Best uh, Visual Effects. Wow. Okay. Yeah. And I think uh, Jessica Lane got Best Newcomer that year as well. This All right. So, yeah. Well, are you ready to see a whole new side of King Kong? I guess so. Let's do it. Let's climb the buildings. But first, like, comment, subscribe. Come hang out with us for King Kong. Yeah. And check out our Patreon link down below for more early access to our videos. Link to our access to polls helps figure out our next. Links down there. Check it out. Let's watch. King Kong. Did you even say words? I don't think you even said words there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ha ha ha. Yeah. Ha. Surabaya, Indonesia. Well, that fucked everything up. Some headwire. They only loaded me enough pipe to push one test hole. Less than 2,000 feet. Is that Jaws? Yes, I was just thinking that. Like, that guy looks just like Jaws. Yeah. Or the Happy Gilmore guy with the nail in his head, which is the same person as Jaws. Yeah. How are you this evening? <laughs> he looks steady on his feet. All right. His hat really ties the whole, whole outfit together. Think he meant to drop that money? Probably. A lousy forecast, all right. My advice is we stay here in Sura by another 48 hours. Hell with the weather. Every hour we delay gives Shell or Exxon a chance of beating us to the island. Is that the Beethoven dad? I have not seen Beethoven in 30 years. I would not know. <laughs> Oh yeah, he definitely meant to drop the cash. He's sneaking on the boat. <laughs> like he didn't hit those guys on the boat with his bag. Sweet climbing skills. Dino De Laurentiis. We just watched something made by him. He did a lot of 80s movies. The Laurentiis family did. Conan? Conan? Was, yeah. Yeah. King Kong. The eighth wonder of the world. Introducing Jessica Lange. Her first role. Her huh? first ever film role. Nice. <laughs> He's been just hiding in a boat. Apparently. Wonder how many snacks he packed. Hopefully a bunch. <laughs> you know, for some reason, I'm reminded of Amsterdam. You ever eat a raw herring? With a beer chaser and a scoop of ice cream. <laughs> Captain, 
Captain Air. I picked up a Mayday call, sir. Low power signal. It faded before I could get a fix on the vessel. Hey, check the Singapore Center. Keep listening. Let me know if you're getting it. My eyes, sir. <laughs> it's wet out there. Guess he's not going down to his quarters. <laughs> or maybe he went outside to puke. I would say that. You know, I gotta admit, for a New York desk guy, you got a lot of guts. I sold this one to the board. If that island doesn't produce huge, I'll be wiping windshields. <laughs> it's a big ship. I'd have told you earlier, but I couldn't risk anyone talking until we were on the high seas. Oh, it's not Jaws. It's the guy from Superman. Mm. The big guy from Zod's. I can't remember his name. Okay. I think. That's magic, all right. We're supposed to find oil under 2,000 fathoms of the deep blue sea. They do have similar facial features, though, yeah. don't they? It's the fog bank. You wouldn't look at twice. This is taken from precisely the same camera angle. This picture was taken two weeks ago, 35 years later. A bank of fog that doesn't change a wisp in 35 years. A NASA spy satellite went way off course and photographed it by mistake. So there's a like big link between this and Kong Skull Island, right? Because they're mm. both in the 70s. All satellites finding Skull Island finally. There we are. Now, um, the different colors. That's a piece of chewed gum, different sir. Surface temperatures. Look like somebody just spit their gum out. <laughs> Carbon dioxide, far above normal. Uh, not poisonous, but very damn curious. There are all kinds of things that might account for the excess CO2. For example, one would be animal respiration. Turn the lights on. Why? Where do you come from? Animal breathing. Animal. And there's just a hole to the hollow earth there. In, uh, in 1749, a waterlogged lifeboat was found in the same area. It was empty, but drawn in blood from thy wedding with the creature who touches heaven. Lady, God preserve thee. Perfectly normal. Passage. You're a stowaway? No, Jack Prescott. I'm from Princeton, Department of Primate Paleontology. Are you lying hippie? You're from another oil company. How did you know about this? All right, man, the meeting is over. This man's got one of our T-shirts. You issue a T-shirt, you keep a record of everybody he's got. All right, where'd you get this? He was wearing that when he went on. Passport for the last time. Who the hell are you? I am Jack Prescott. I've got the picture on the back of the book. Dingling. Yes, that. Take his lousy spy below till he's hungry enough to stop spouting ape shit. Leave the sandwich here. Get him out. Yeah, throw him overboard. Totally. Look out, there's something out there. About two o'clock. Use your glasses. Come back here with you. Bitch, it's a raft. A raft. It's a dinghy. There's somebody in it. Or at least an arm. Jessica Lang. How'd she get there? There was that mayday they heard him during the storm. Oh, yeah. Her yacht sank. Look at how fancy she looks. She's alive! Woo! Finally a woman on the boat! <laughs> She's probably some millionaire on a yacht. Mm-hmm. You all clear out of here? I'll jam her now? I guess you'll have to undress her, huh? Well, it's usual. In case of, uh... Internal injuries or multiple shock syndrome? Perko, get out of here. <laughs> Good choice, Captain. Clean, everything checks out. Fingerprints, guy's kosher. Except for he spells Jack Fuck. <laughs> it's smelling salt, salt on him. Might probably on a first date kit. Yeah, probably have the first date kit. Yeah. Where's Harry and everyone? Were they on the raft before? I'm afraid the yacht didn't get very far after the SOS. Radio Singapore reports that someone has already found a piece of charred hoe. How many people were on the boat? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Duran. D-W-A-N, Duan. That's my name. You know? Like Don, except that... Except I switched two letters. 
Yeah. Just want it on me now. Love it. Dwan. Are we headed back to Singapore? Uh, not directly, ma'am. I guess it doesn't matter. I'm in no rush. Do you have someone we should call? Harry probably wouldn't have put me in that movie anyhow. She seems a little cray-cray. Harry was showing this film that I refused to watch. And that's why I was up on deck by myself when the yacht exploded. You your life to a porno? Did you ever meet anyone before? She refused to watch because it was like porn, right? She was. What? She was. Deep throat. That's what she just said? Yeah. <laughs> I knew it was a porno. You know, maybe my luck has changed. You owe your life to a porno. Get those flares. Bell bottom jeans. Actually, look really good on him. Bell bell bottom jeans. They look uh -huh. good on him. Oh, you mean the side booby? Right, almost. She really made that mechanics outfit her own, huh? Yes, she did. Anchor right outside the fog bank. What was that? Ah, uh, just a glitch. False echo off a flock of birds. Maybe. Probably a giant lizard. Hi there. How do you like this for beachwear? Fantastic. <laughs> you said I could come ashore on the first boat. You really should wait until the recon is gone, ma'am. Oh, the hell I. Yeah. Then you've got to have me in it. You know, the all-American girl saved from an exploding yacht by deep throat. <laughs> <laughs> I need a break, and after all, you do owe it to me. Why? Because I am a holder of a Petrox credit card, you know. <laughs> Ron, you come ashore with us. <laughs> Captain, she'll come ashore. Well, she, does, she doesn't uh, cause any problems, huh? What's the worst she could do? The last boat she was on blew up. Do you think she blew it up? You know, I she seems a little crazy. Before I flew out to Hong Kong. Watch your step. Up. And it said that I was going to cross over water and meet the biggest person in my life. <sighs> Bring on King Kong himself. I think her and Jack are going to get married. That's what her horoscope meant. Oh, you think? Yeah. And they would never see it again. Do we know how to get back to the boat through the fog? Marco! Skull Island. We just broke through. The landing beach dead ahead. Two words, no problem. You could totally bring the bigger boat in through the clouds and anchor it. Depends on how deep the water is, though. Yeah. Isn't there an earlier version of King Kong? Yeah, 1933. 33? Yeah. That's the, one 30... we've, that's the one I've seen. Yeah. How are they gonna get the boat out of there? Push it. You wanna start setting seismic charges this morning, huh? Absolutely. Can't tell a thing until we map the geological structure. That's what they did in uh, Kong School Island, or, yeah. Kong School Island, they dropped charges and pissed them off. Yeah, it didn't work out very well for them. Just like an, uh, you know, undiscovered island. You might not just want to run around willy-nilly. What an idiot. Do 
Just drinking water from a ra random stream. Just stick close by me, okay? I think she's smitten. Not in Cabo here, you know? You think she's smitten? Yeah. Wish she was looking at him. She clearly needs a father figure to tell her not to be an idiot. Do we leave ourselves breadcrumbs so we know how to get back? Just follow the creek. as old as the pyramids of Egypt. Could be. The only difference is the pyramids weren't repaired six months ago. Wait a minute, are you trying to tell me there's people on this island? Yes, I am. The island is uninhabited. Says the guy that got there 25 minutes ago. And then finds a wall. <laughs> uninhabited. Now three, there's an uninhabited German beer hall in there with a mechanical band. <laughs> Let's go towards the drums. Look at that drum line. I think that's close enough. Yeah, like what are you guys doing? Sneaking up on people um, who've lived on an island by themselves doesn't seem like a good idea. wedding ceremony sure <laughs> somebody's getting married or a sacrifice ceremony could be both you think it could be uh, <clears throat> sure as hell could be oil probably just chocolate hey Jack maybe it's a wedding a good guess Better schedule for tonight when the moon's full. No, oh, it's a full moon tonight. So every full moon they uh, sacrifice have a wedding. someone. Oh yeah, Con. Show me your moves. You might say uh, it's the groom's stand-in. The actual groom's on the other side of the wall. Oh, you mean it's bad luck if they see each other before the wedding? It is Kong, huh? You've been made. Hopefully they're not cannibals. Jack, you want to talk for us? Don't even know what language they speak. Oh, cool. No. They want Dwan. <laughs> like, we don't want to sacrifice one of our own. We'll sacrifice that lady instead. It's like, we'll give you one of those girls for her. Six of them for Dwan. Oh, all six of them? No! Oh boy. Has Kong been asking for a, a white lady? Well, the wig they were putting on was white. It was blonde. It was like. Yeah, why? That's weird. <clears throat> He's got a thing for blondes. Yeah, but how do they know? We still got her back to the ship, huh? Ooh, they're coming to take her. You know, you really shouldn't go ashore tonight. It's not a good night for Aries like you. How'd you know I was an Aries? By the shape of your ears. It's unique. All right, so I asked Fred Wilson. He knows everything. No. About but really, I wish you wouldn't go ashore tonight. Oh, you think it'd be better to watch some old movie with the crew? Well, no, of course not. <laughs> There's nothing else to do in this ship. Eighty times around the decks a mile, we could jog. 
I think she was thinking about something more horizontal. Mm-hmm. Something with a plow. A plow? She was to be plowed by. Oh, Jesus. Hey, uh, you'll disappoint me if you're here when I get back. What do you mean you'll be disappointed? Well, I was hoping you'd be waiting for me in your cabin. <laughs> oh, there you go. She's gonna get stolen by the... By the Kong people. <laughs> Impeccable timing on their part. Yeah. Stealthy, too. Has to be the biggest ever. No problems at all. Well, you're the boss. Don't worry about it, Roy. This guy. He wants his oil. We well, got her prepped fast. Sure did. Wasted no time. Got her drunk on that berry juice they got on the island. She's loose. I wish you'd dance like that for me. I can. I'll put my Godzilla mask on for you, too. <laughs> what are they greasing up? Slide the, the bar open. Settle down. <laughs> I like the burlap stuff that those other priests have. Like, what creature is that supposed to represent? Is like the other Kongs, not the main King Kong? I don't know. Ghosts? I don't know. Uh, the Kong's ancestors? Mm -hmm. Like, hurry up, we gotta watch this! Everybody get to the top! There's a lot of fire on that large wooden fence. Yep. She is wasted. Here comes the big guy. He looks pretty small. I mean, in comparison to the other Kongs we've seen, you know. Yeah, I think he's smaller than Kong Squad, but not the other King Kong movies. No. 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 Saying, finally a natural blonde. It's probably like just like my dad said he had one time. <laughs> Do they have enough men to open that gate? If he's still out there, the lights will hold him back. Don't shoot. He's long gone. He's got a lady to wine and dine. I'm once taken. Who the hell do you think went through there? Some guy in an ape suit? Actually, that's exactly... Just a really big guy in an ape suit. <laughs> you alright? Just throw in a goddamn hole. You're not in a hole. That's a footprint. That footprint I fell into measured out at six feet four inches. If that were for real, how high would that make him? Well, uh, multiply by about eight, I guess. Forty feet tall? You look bigger than that. I don't, I don't have a good grasp on like, what measurements or what, you know. He's not going to eat her. Why did he take her? Don't know. 
said that you said the ape was going to marry her. Is that some kind of joke, or did you really mean this huge ape? I don't know, Carnahan. God, I'm as ignorant as you are about this. The guys are just wondering if they're going to consummate the marriage. Right. <laughs> they want to know how they're going to get an ape dick in a, in a, a little gal, you know? How's that going to happen? I mean, it's promising that he hasn't eaten you yet, you know? Can try to run. He, he's very big feet. And the animatronics in this are so cool. It's a big hand for yeah. animatronics, huh? It's so well controlled. Yeah. Knock it off, lady. Uh, he's way bigger than 40 feet tall. I can't stand it! Honest, I can't. When I was 10 years old, it took me up in the Empire State Building and I got sick in the elevator. You put me down! Honestly, the video quality is so good for the 70s, I feel like, just until those little green screen moments, right? Yeah. But other than that, like, I don't thought this would have, I mean, this could have been made, you know, in the 90s. He's like, hey. You're just winning him over. He's like, I, she's feisty and not afraid of me. I like it. <laughs> I like my woman feisty. Sometimes I get too physical. It's a sign of insecurity, you know? Like, like when you knock down trees. Such a nice safe. <laughs> you know, we're going to be great friends. I'm a Libra. <laughs> I bet you're an Aries, aren't you? Of course you are. I just knew it. <laughs> Think he's an Aries? He seems more like a Leo to me. Okay. No? He's not gonna let her go. Radar reports ahead of him on the screen for about 30 seconds. 3.6 kilometers west of your flare. He was reported moving in a random manner. Sure about that, huh? He wasn't moving in our direction? Affirmative, random, like in a circle. Hey, he's keeping Tuan from running away. <laughs> there is a girl out there who might be running for her life from some gigantic turned on ape. Jack, I know how you feel. I feel the same. There's a national energy crisis which demands that we all rise above our private selfish interests. <laughs> That's rich. Come on, let's get going. <laughs> Busting my ass for no white company, white man. <laughs> oh, okay, take your time. Who gives a shit that Radar has got the ape headed in our direction? <laughs> Oh, it's taking her to get cleaned up. Yeah, she got all muddy. I know, it's sweet. What t shirt contest? That's what he was hoping for, right? You mean the booty? Waterproof the the arm too. Nature's Dyson. Gotta blow dry that hair. <laughs> I 
He's such a sweetheart. <laughs> he likes her. Sweet. Like I said, it will be real great oil as soon as Mother Nature finishes cooking it a little longer. How much longer? Shit. Another 200 years. Tick of the clock as geological time goes. Say, uh, 10,000 years. 10,000? Oh, no. It's too close to the surface. You shouldn't have radioed New York. You were bringing in the big one. Oh, you're going to get your face hit pretty hard. Who says I ain't gonna? Wilson to Explorer. Get me a clear channel to serve by. I want to arrange an airdrop right away. Oh, no. Airdrop? Do you walk across that? I feel like I'd either run or crawl on all fours. I feel like I trust myself more running. Because if you're running, you don't have time to think about it. Yeah. Oh, no. You're all gonna die. You about the first mate? Oh no. Oh shit, they're they are all gonna die. Oh. Oh boy. Careful, Kong doesn't fall off the cliff. Just out of reach. To find a new way across that huge canyon. Climb like your life depended on it. Are they dropping? I don't know. Barrel of monkeys. Beach Greta Carnahan, report back immediately. Do nothing to endanger Kong. They're dead. Really, the shape of those footsteps in that dirt there going up the hill. What did they do with the natives? They they ran for it after the fireworks show. That's rude. Whoa! He made what? it out. Ooh, we took her to the hot springs. A volcano? Oh, come on, Kong, forget about me. This thing's just never gonna work. Can't you see? I have a feeling he's gonna find a way to make it work. He's undressing her with his fingertip. Oh. Oh no. You mean Jessica Lang's boobies? That's a big snake. I don't know where Conan got his snake. Oh, that's Conan's snake, you think? <laughs> they might have reused it. Head looks a little different, though. He's strong. That's why they call him King Kong. The king of the island. Totally. We gotta do it! 
Are you ready? Her, her drawers are falling down. Dresses are under her knees. Where's that river go? I don't know, but she has no pants anymore. Who needs pants? You sure that monkey will be able to bust through that gate? I'm sure Kong could get through that wall if he wanted to. For sure. Barrels of chloroform? I don't know. Some kind of knockout juice, huh? He's really pissed. They're like, shit, man, open the door. That door's not gonna last much longer. We didn't dump it too soon. Come on, buddy, get through. Gee, many. Here's Johnny. It worked. That's surprising. It's a great shot. I called in a bigger boat. Yeah, they need a bigger one if they're going to carry Kong. A really, really big boat. The insides hold him. How do you keep him docile? Drugs. Keep him tranked. It's like not even a half a bowl of tricks. I <laughs> know. It's like fruity pebbles down there. Still wanna play? Do you know how to play backgammon? What? No, but I can learn pretty quick, I bet. Congratulations. Mm. Maybe you could learn and teach me. Dwan! We open in New York. Lights, cameras, Kong. Hey. Any chance of you two kids getting married? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe we think of some nutty way of Kong giving away the bride. It is nutty. I don't know. What do you think, Jack? Are they even dating yet? <laughs> I mean, he saved her life, so... Yeah, twice. It's an animal, a beast, to try to rape you. That's not true. He risked his life to save me. Try to rape you, honey. See, before you cry a lot, you ought to ask the natives on that island what they thought of losing Kong. Actually, they'll miss him a lot. He was their god. He was the terror, the mystery of their lives, and the magic. A year from now, that'll be an island full of burnout drunks. When we took Kong, we kidnapped their god. All they got left is the berry juice they gave Dwan. You want me to cable Harvard or Yale and get Kong another keeper? Coast to coast tours, Beauty and the Beast, it's a grotesque farce. You, you say the word, Jack. Your contract is torn up. You just tell me right now, right now. Say it. Would you want to go see the Kong show? No. Why not? Too risky. Too risky, okay. Also, there'd probably be a lot of other people there. I'm just not, not into other people. What if I was there? Definitely not, then. <sighs> Again, proportions are just not quite right. If that's a 40-foot ape, that handkerchief... Would be like six feet tall, right? <laughs> I think he's bigger than 40 feet. Wait a minute, I'll be right back. He knows she's having sex and he just is so mad about it. I hope that boat can hold him. Ah! 
Oh, oh shit. shit. Seawater pumps to full pressure. Prepare to flood tank number four. Shit. Remember me, you blind gate? Oh, come on. You haven't forgotten me, have you? She's gonna have to move in. Do what? Stop! Stop or I'll jump! Don't flood the tank! Oh, nice catch. You just gonna let her go this time? I guess. He's actually very calm now. You so sleepy? I mean, Jessica Lang is kind of dreamy, so... Understand what's happening. <laughs> he probably has pheromones. They both their pheromones just put each other to sleep. Yeah, he's got pheromones only the ladies can sense, and she's calming him. You gotta think of the man musk of a Kong that size. It would be ripe, I'm sure. It's the Petrux Marching Band. They're my favorite oil company marching band. Mm. I'm quitting your circus, Brett. You big idiot. You signed a contract. You took an advance. Sue me. Come with me right now. Come on, to hell with a contract. Oh, she's not going. She's going to be famous. Yeah, she signed the contract. Oh, Jack, don't you understand? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Also, if she leaves Kong, Kong's gonna be very sad. Yeah. You are seeing this live around the world. Live as it is happening across the East River from New York City. You have even better seats than these lucky Petrox King Kong contest winners invited here tonight. Yeah, they win a contest to go there? And thus, Beauty set foot on the Forbidden Island and was seized. And great was the fear and trembling as beauty was lashed to the dreadful bridal altar of the beast. How much song and dance going on? No kidding. <laughs> Don't get too close, folks. That's just a giant gas pump. Great marketing. This is just a big commercial. And now you can build your own King Kong with these challenging King Kong model kits. You need no glue, no special tools. Just snap together and paint it, and you have a realistic model of Kong fighting the giant snake. Or for a real challenge, build King Kong on top of the Twin Towers. When you're finished, they make a great addition to any kid's room. complete with easy to follow picture instructions by Mika. They made a big crown for him. I mean, he looks handsome. Very royal. And Petrox. There is nothing one ever fear. That is an escape proof cage certified by the New York City Department. Oh, then yeah, it's gonna be fine. He's escape proof. Maybe they should have got the state government to, you know, check that cage. Not just the city government. Tranquilizers on standby. There's only a very few shots of the giant full size animatronic, and they didn't use it very often. So they didn't like how it looked. Ah, uh, there. 
yeah. yeah. It looks way better at Universal. <laughs> Get out of the way! And this is why Petrox went under. All the lawsuits. He deserved that. He's only got eyes for Dwan. We got the Queensboro Bridge all buttoned up. What's the situation at the Brooklyn? Listen, I'll tell that monkey this bridge before he crosses it. I mean, they really should have had a contingency plan. Yeah. It's really poor planning. Lots of uh, horse tranquilizers. Mm hmm. I mean, they already knocked it out with all that chloroform on the island, so they know how to put him down. Oh, he's sniffing her out. Here's where the Universal ride comes in. Yeah. Except for it's a tour tram, it's not a subway. <gasps> oh no. She wasn't Dwan. He just chucked an innocent bystander. He's just not going to drive away on his motorcycle. I know, it would have been faster just to go the other way. Why not just ride the motorcycle? Oh, there's mines. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. He's just gonna swim. Jack! Dewan! <sighs> We've put a ripple between us. The bitches are mined and apes don't swim. Even your own book says, so oh, come on, please, buy me a drink. There's your food. I don't know where, but I've seen this view before. From the 1930 film? No. World Trade Centers didn't exist in the 30s. Yeah, they were just built when this movie came out. Why did he have deja vu then? He doesn't have to swim. He can walk in the water. Do you still want me? Oh, steal someone else's jacket. I asked you a question. <sighs> You're kind of bad news bears, right? Like, <laughs> You've been through so much excitement, it's in your blood like dope. You're going to need new fixes that I'm not going to be able to give you. He's right. And she's obviously a size queen now. Totally. He won't ever be able to compare to Kong. <laughs> That blackout they had here once, and all the little babies that were born exactly nine months later. Uh -huh. Well, here's to all the future sons and daughters of King Kong. She's saying she wants to make one of those. Yeah, she's saying, "What else do you do when when the power's out?" You know. I'll go flip the breakers after this movie. <laughs> Him of home. I think we've got a chance. Sit tight. I'm gonna make a phone call. Chance for what? To kept catch him again. Where is he headed, Professor Prescott? We deal for that. You promise to capture him without injury, then I'll tell you where. Cause yeah, they're they're gonna keep their promises, right? Oh yeah, government always does that. He found her. He's got a very strong nose. Oh, 
want to say some Hail Marys. He's coming down Fifth Avenue right on schedule, almost to 42nd Street. Watch out for ghosts. I heard that place is haunted. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Well, they have a telepathic thing going on, huh? Think so. Seems like it. The helicopters are coming to net him! Think a net would keep him down? It's a lot of floors. Is that the Empire State Building right there? Yeah, it's a nice touch. It wasn't the tallest building anymore. I don't even think it was in the 1930s, but... Might have been. It's their anniversary. It's been a whole month. <laughs> he is ready to consummate that marriage. No kidding. Look at those eyes. What the hell are those men doing up there? Uh oh. Got some heroes. This guy's got a flamethrower. Yeah. Oof. That was a big jump. Ballsy. Now Jack's on the wrong building. Oh shit. Here come the nets. So weird looking nets. <laughs> no, hold on to me or they'll kill you. Oh no. You're just gonna do one of these. Someone got a little too close. No. He's defending his woman. Just got two more to take down and he'll be all right. He's just got to lie down for a little bit. He'll be all right. Yeah. Look out below. Did you land on anybody? Doesn't look like it. King Kong's about to die here. Hmm. Died looking at the one he loved. Oh, so beautiful. Think her 15 minutes of fable last? No. King Kong. Can't believe they killed him. Well, about that. There's a sequel to this. So they didn't kill him? They resuscitated Kong? I don't know. Hmm. But the movie's called King Kong Lives. Ooh. They made it 10 years after this, 1986. So we'll watch that sometime. Can't wait. Yeah. But yeah, we got Jeff Bridges and Jessica Lange. Mm hmm. Both very young. Yeah. A lot of fun. So much fun. Great practical effects. I think this is the first time Kong 
No, no. The Japanese put Kong in a man, the man in a Kong suit for 13 Kong movies. So. Okay. First American film with a man in a giant Kong suit yeah. for most of it. Nailed it. And then great puppetry on the face. Yeah. Doing all the facial expressions. Like when he's blowing her dry and mm-hmm. big old smiles on her. And the hand. The hand. The hand, yeah, the hand was is awesome. Cool. Yeah. Especially when the, he like catches her or gets her out of the water. Mm-hmm. The fact that they got it all waterproof and all that stuff is really cool. So it's so cool. And a lot of that stuff they end up using in the Universal, you know, tour ride for yeah. the Kong, King Kong part. So lots of fun. Very nice. And the iconic World Trade Center mm-hmm. is the finale. And then I just always remember the the poster of is him standing. Be on one foot on each tower. Oh yeah, but he's not nearly that big. <laughs> no. And uh, it's funny is there was a Godzilla movie that came out the year after this mm-hmm. with a similar poster with Godzilla fighting. I think it was Megalon hmm. on top of the World Trade Center just to copy the poster. Oh yeah, on this one of this King Kong. So each of them were standing on one of the towers. Cute. But yeah, they had to show off the tallest building. The, the time of this movie. What are your thoughts? It's good. There's parts of it that drug on a little bit too long, but that's all right. Yeah. So you, this is even the longest Kong movie. I know. Or the longest cut of this movie. In this uh, DVD set, there's actually the broadcast TV version. They added like 60 minutes to it to make it a two-night event. I'm glad, glad we didn't watch that yeah, version. They also make they edit it for TV. You don't want to watch that. No. No I'd blood. Hate that. No boob. You want to see. Be worthless. The real cut. Where would you rank it in King Kong films? This is the, other than Skull Island, this is the only time it's not set in the 30s. Yeah, it's maybe not the as, as good as King Kong Skull Island, but. Man. Yeah. Other than that, I mean, it, similar. Similar. Yeah. Oh, they're both good. Similar feel with the 60s or the 70s and yeah. the oil and the charges they were doing yeah. finding it with satellites and all that kind of stuff the skull island though is they don't ever take him off the he lives so yeah that's why i like that one better yeah this week he's back for more totally. can't wait to go see that oh yeah me me too super chat you're not gonna go to theaters with us no we'll save it for our channel though can't wait we'll take the girls or at least try me okay so i know she's excited I'm sure maybe we'll want to go too, though. All right. Well, thanks for hanging out for King Kong. Tell us what you liked best about this one. Yeah. And what do you think of Jessica Lange's performance? Yeah. A lot of people pan it, thinking she wasn't like, I don't think she did that bad of a job. At the beginning, when Dwan's like first waking up and she's talking about, I changed my letters and my name, she's kind of. It seems a little off, but I take that as her acting. She's kind of a weird, flighty character. So, yeah. Like when she's. Feeling for Kong and you know running right. It all feels pretty real for me. So yeah, it's not bad. Works for me. Yeah. Let us know all your thoughts on King Kong, where this ranks, mm-hmm. and all the King Kong adaptations, and more. Yeah. yeah. Come back next week. And check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos, one coming access to bulls up to pick what's next. Links down there. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.